welcome to Dun Dun Dun, an all female, all awesome D and D fifth edition homebrew interactive podcast, Twitch stream, and YouTube archive. Like we sound super fancy. Um, I sit in my homebrew world of Calendos, my being me, being Carla, and I am the GM and creator of said world. And around the table, I have my fantastic players, and they're going to... Oh, gosh. Sorry, I have a Red Bull behind you, and I was nearly like... <laughs> and then I was going to be like, you guys see a... Something. Splodge. <laughs> um, they're going to introduce themselves. I'm going to tell you where we are and how the interactivity works, if this is your first time. If not, it's always good to have a refresher. So, starting from... Let's do a difference. Starting from across the way. Hey. Hi guys, um, my name is Nicole and I will be playing the character Stacy, not to be mistaken for Stacy. That's all. <laughs> Hi guys, I'm Nelly, aka Miss Mvubu, and I'm going to be playing Kira Nightingale. Mm. And I'm Wednesday and I'm playing Lauren Skyvale, the Paladin. So, how it works is it is interactive. Hey, and your guys, I'm sorry if, if I pr- mispronounce your, your usernames, that's on me. <laughs> and I'm sorry, but hey, Zaref, welcome, welcome, good day, good evening. Um, also, I'm glad you're excited for the duckening. Hello, Hero 27. <laughs> <laughs> so, how it works if this is your first time, because Zaref, this is the first time I haven't, uh, I haven't seen you in the chat before, so maybe you've been here before, but not chatted. Is as the game goes on, you are welcome to throw in some things. Henceforth, why this episode is called the Duckening, mm-hmm. uh, thanks to uh, chat last week. But also try and be specific, otherwise I'm going to take it in a weird way. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like 100%, it will always be weird if I do it. <laughs> so uh, throw in ideas, and if I can work them into the story, I will. I feel like it's really started to create a really rad vibe about <laughs> about the show. So without further ado. Actually, no, I lied. It is more further ado. <laughs> <laughs> we are going to ado further. <laughs> um, so we are a South African podcast, and over the weekend we held another role-playing mm. day at Timeless Board Games, which is in Edenvale. If you are in South Africa, you mm. would know where that is. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe <laughs> I'm you don't. geographically challenged. So. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Wednesday and Nicole were there, so just a recap of how it went and what the vibe was like, because we were really excited to... Introduce the game to more new people, get more people playing and finding each other. And we're hoping to have lots more events like that at our two favorite stores, one being Timeless and the other being the amazing store that lets us come here every Tuesday. They're called the Nexus (laughs) Hub. So if you are in South Africa, please come check them out. But quick two minutes of a doing of how (laughs) Timeless Board Games was. Okay, so I GM'd both sessions at Timeless Board Games. It was like a spooky-themed kind of uh, RPG and board gaming day. Plenty of space. Everybody could come. All ages, all everything came. Well, People like, dressed up. Well, says it was super fun. Yeah, it was, it was a lot of fun. Um, I got to run like full tables, like overflowing tables of people. Uh, so the GMing was a lot of fun. Thanks, guys. I got a lot of new players as well. I hope you guys had fun. I had fun like GMing you because you guys were all awesome. Um, yes, and thank you, Times Board Games. I had fun. That's a lot of the words fun. Yes. So it was a lot of fun. fun. <laughs> it the was fun. fun. And it was awesome. No, although not necessarily all female, which mm. is also awesome. Yeah, it definitely wasn't all female, but there were um, a large, like there was a large female presence. Uh, nice. And there was also a large male presence. <laughs> there were there was just a lot of <laughs> presences. There was presences. a lot. There was a large male presence that were definitely eyeing our female presence. Oh, so your charisma bonus was high. You know what happened? Super it was high. because I was pretending to be Carla. That's yeah, high. guys. Yes. <laughs> people, people were, and then I looked at these streams, <laughs> and even though I brushed my hair, it looks like I haven't brushed my hair, guys. I, I do brush my hair. <laughs> <laughs> and, and I actually and I actually YouTube consult and help people be better at video and my, the first thing I always say to them is like guys you're on camera just look like you brushed your hair <laughs> so no I don't think that's a thing no I was serious it was real you can ask Tian he was like yes okay you call her today I'm like yes I'm call her okay good yeah I mean, a very weird a charisma caller <laughs> well look whatever you guys are doing it was working it was totally working <laughs> so I'm just gonna do some shout outs also hey Philip by the way 
Uh, Who's Philip? Zareph is Philip. Ah. He was one of our GMs at Comic Con, yeah. Uh, hey, and then there's Jazz Jar and FJ and, and Maureen. We've got, it's lucky to see that we're getting some like uh, usual suspects. Nice. Yes, yeah. mm, I like that's it. That's nice. Uh, Rureen, just for you, this episode is called The Duckening. <laughs> the Duckening. All right. Where we were last week mm. is um, Kira Hi. had just attacked the last uh, Vagul, which is a flying um, vicious alien head thing on a set of wings. And then we had to end the stream because it was time to end the stream. <laughs> <laughs> for, for reasons. For reasons. For reasons we cannot say on camera. <laughs> I mean, we could, but... It's, it's but okay. uh, that brings it to uh, Lauren. It seems to be barely flapping, but it's still there. Um, can I just put my sword through it? I mean, can you roll the I dice and we will see? Woo. I don't know. <coughs> it's a game of chance. Do I have to do it carefully? What do you mean carefully? No, with, a, with disadvantage, like before. For a second, I was going to say no because uh, <laughs> Kira left. But uh, <laughs> Kira didn't leave. The player left <laughs> the table. <laughs> so, yes, you do have to do it carefully. Your sword is great yeah. and the space is not. <laughs> 13. 13. 13 does hit. Oh, yes. That's awesome. Roll your damage. 11 as you slice through the the vogel it actually splits and if you look carefully at the split you can see it appears the top layer of leather skin sort of embeds into a, a host Jesus, this thing is so cool yeah and <laughs> um, nasty <laughs> There's, it, it looks from the inside of the brain, you imagine it's a human head. I don't know. I've never seen the inside of a human head before. Haven't you, though? No, I haven't. All right. We're going to drop out of initiative as all five, well, four of them, and then you imagine one down the corridor <laughs> <laughs> is, is dead. Um, everyone roll perception for me. Ooh. It perception. is a nasty parasite. They're really cool monsters. You must check them out. Nat Five. 20. Nat, nat 20. 20. Did you also get a Nat well, 20? I 24 if you want to like oh. be Did specific. you also get two Nat 20s? I promise yeah. you, yeah. Guys, yeah. I just got to say, what a waste. <laughs> I know, because it's a perception check. No, no. I mean, look, gonna, the 20s are going to start rolling yeah. from here on out. I feel like I need to give you some, because uh, there's two natural 20s. Should we get 20s. inspiration? Yeah. Times two. How Times two. How do you get inspiration for a dice Guys, roll? inspiration is for like playing your character really well. Um, you know what? The chat can tell me what the bonus is for the fact that two nat 20s rolled at the same time. Um, what yeah. did you get? Five. <laughs> <laughs> it's like not 20. Look, this is the first time Alarn has killed anything. You are he very is, desperate. He is upset. freaking out on the inside. But on the outside, he's looking stoic. And your sword looks a bit... Uh, Dirty? You, yeah, you don't know. Actually, you're not sure if you know how to clean your sword. Ew. Of like brain gunk. There's a okay, little bit I'm of brain crying, I'm not crying. I'm not crying. I'm okay. <laughs> I'm okay. Okay. Um, Rureen says, shame. I'm going to do that because Rureen was uh, the fastest on the trigger. I'm going to give you guys high fives. That's what you get. <laughs> <laughs> I am so disappointed. <laughs> so, Wi-Fi. I mean, look, we love you, but come on, guys. <laughs> Could you just please love us <laughs> back? Guys, you're getting high fives. Come now. Wi-Fi. Making the clap sound. There so it was like such a... You can, you can have a baby five. Boop. <laughs> see, at least I appreciate it. Yeah, see, that's... You got a five. Wow. <laughs> oh, I got a baby five. You should give it's her different. the high five because she got a five. <laughs> Look, you got a high five. Just be thankful. I normally don't just hand those out for free. Okay? I mean, we... You like have to make a funny people. joke or something. I'm just saying. Cool, 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 cool. Cool, 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 cool. cool. Let's not fight about it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, so you are very disgusted at your sword. Yes. I see you here at 27. I'm getting good at not actually reading what it is because then I spoil it for the players. Yeah. <laughs> I don't yeah. like it when you do so that. It, it, it went from high fives to like something like a really low gift to like it's just stacking now. 
gifts. Guys, gift yeah. remember, keep it casual, these gifts. <laughs> nice gifts. Nice gifts. Speaking of gifts, so we found out something. Sorry, we're learning about Twitch. Is uh, Some of our, people who are Prime subscribers on Amazon Prime can donate uh, gifts from different games on Amazon. Well, not on Amazon. Well, different games on Twitch. Twitch, sorry. Woo! And it's called, it's Amazon Prime loot that only Prime members get. And they donate it to what is called our community chest. And we can give it away to people who are watching our streams. So I'm going to ask our amazing tech support team to do that now. To do what? So they got to press give it away. Did we do it? Yay! So everybody, you get a whatever's in the community chest, and you get, we don't get it. They oh. get it. Oh, I thought uh. she was going to be like, you get inspiration. No, you don't get it. You got a high five. <laughs> Listen, you can't blame a girl for trying. Okay? Look, no, for sure. If you don't ask, you don't get Exactly. So can we get inspiration? No. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> and, a, and a big thank you, because I know Atrocious donated to that community chest. So big thank you to Thanks, Atrocious. Guys. Thank you. Um... All right. What the two natural 20s see? Yes. High fives. <laughs> you see the, the mage hand, a mage hand just giving you a high fives. No, you do not. Um, you see floating in the sewer, but it's weird because as I told you, the sewer had almost dried up mm. of the, the magic oil. So it's floating above where... A water where the oil line should be is a clockwork duck just uh, paddling and the two of you can see that the clockwork has the same key that is in Ooh. that was in is placed in all the people that have been murdered um, and it's just swimming along in sort of mid-air above the sewer area and you can hear a slight whirring of the clockwork inside. And as you look at it, you realize that what you thought was a, a very quick glance that was a painted wooden duck is actually, it looks taxidermied. So it looks like it was a real duck. That sounds like a That boy. was painted, <laughs> painted yellow. Oh, I'm sure it again. <laughs> Mm. So that's just paddling along mm. in midair. You do not see that. No, I, d I, I, I don't see it. So um, um, can I, re may I please go and retrieve my javelin from down the passage? You can start walking down the passage. As he starts walking down the passage, his footfalls make, bring something to your attention mm. that the whirring of the clockwork sounds like a timer. I was going to ask if it was a bomb. So thank you for that, <laughs> Lauren. Uh, thank you for what? Walking away. Thank you for being in distress and going away. <laughs> 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 Lauren's walking away holding his greatsword and just like, <sighs> <sighs> what do? Is, it, uh, is the duck ahead of us or where Lauren's walked towards? So the duck is almost coming from the, the smaller outlet that this tunnel eventually leads to. Yeah. So it's probably, and that's also why you could only really see the, hear that it was a timer. Mm. Um, it's probably 15 feet away from you, and Lauren started walking away from you, so he's 25 feet away from the timer. Does it have, like, numbers on it? Like, so, I mean, is it, like, counting down mm. to something? Like, can we see that visibly? No, so you just... You thought initially the whirring you heard was the mechanics working, mm -hmm. yeah. but you realize that because you guys both scored so high, you realize that the whirring does sound like a timer more than the mechanics because if it's taxidermied and it just has a clockwork key, where's the space for the clockwork inside? So it's not gears turning. And... You hear it's it started as with a gentle gentle whir that was sort of monotone, but now the whirring is getting louder and actually starting to slow down, although the duck is paddling at the same rate. Okay. Um first of all we need we need to get away from that. Um It is very small. It's it's probably you guys can see because you have like 
elf eyes of amazing. It's still daylight. It is still da- well. It's it's getting oh, less daylight yeah. as Lauren's walking away. Oh yeah, oh, with your like your scarf of yeah. brilliant scarf of yes. a scarf of, of light. sunlight. Yeah, yeah. Um, um, oh, your guys! I just had a, that sunlight, sunlight, and more. It's a very old advert. You can't put I'm water in because I'm wearing plate armor, like full full plate armor. Water How are you is not wash your sword? This, is not good. This is why your sword's mm-hmm. going to stay dirty good. and gross. No, please don't say it's that. It's going to be nasty. <laughs> um, it's y- the size of the duck is probably uh, between your two hands. Okay. Wood. If we have... It's not made of wood. (laughs) It's made of duck. (laughs) It's a duck. Um, (laughs) If I had to... Also, Hero 27, you're welcome. (laughs) This is such a strange question. It was not a bomb. But it is now. Okay, great. If Um, I had to run and pull out the, the key... I feel like this is such a... I can't even ask this question because you're not yeah, going to answer I'm not gonna, me. I'm going to be like, I okay. don't know. You tell me. I am going. <laughs> you, you're probably like, GM, if I did this, am I going to die? Yeah. <laughs> am I going to die? Okay, wait, hold on. Um, Kira, do you think if <laughs> She's like, oh I've got Kira to do it. <laughs> <laughs> go pull out the key. Listen, be a slay queen and just go pull out the key. And then Kira, die. <laughs> Kira, do you think if we pull out the key, we will die? I think it's a very good possibility, so we need a Where's the evidence. paladin? I'm, he's walking I'm, away. I'm, I'm walking away. I am. I'm, I'm going away. to yeah, retrieve like my javelin oh. um, and, and keep walking because I'm really distressed at the moment. Does um, anyone have Ray of Frost? <laughs> Does anyone? <laughs> Just Maybe. randomly shout into the tunnel. <laughs> Does anyone <laughs> These dice are rolling the same number. Oh no! Can I roll? Um, I, I want to like. I'm going to walk. Start walking back slowly, but I want to roll investigation. Walking back which way? Towards Lauren, where Lauren's going. At this, can everyone please make a Constitution saving throw, guys? I was literally rolling, and I was like, when it gets under twenty, the bomb's gonna go off, and I got a one. Nine. Whoa. Six. Nineteen. <laughs> the one who's the closest stomach, like, to the goat. bomb. So being so close to the bomb, and you were very aware of it, and you were look at, really looking at the key and thinking, "Can I pull? Uh, can I pull the key? Can mm. ducks be evil? Man, the potato ducks are always evil. <laughs> have you not seen that they look super cute, and then underneath they've got like razor teeth? That and is true. Have you seen the, the unnamed duck game? No, no, no. Isn't it a goose? Is it a goose? Well, you know, no, duck, 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 duck goose. goose. Yeah. <laughs> They're related <laughs> somehow. So yeah, that game. Yeah. Evil. Evil. Evil ducks. Evil. Dramatic turn. <laughs> the cold never bothered me anyway. <laughs> <laughs> As you like, who has rain on <laughs> Snow <laughs> on the mountain night. Ducks blowing up oh in the shoes. <laughs> By the way, Carla is fantastic at singing yeah. the song. Do you want to give us a little snippet no, quick? No, guys. This is not what people do came do for. It, do people it. didn't come to hear If you guys want to hear Carla sing Let It Go, just... You know what to do, guys. But also, if they did, I wouldn't tell you. <laughs> I feel like... Okay, no, if you ask for it, I would. But, guys, p- please don't. Do save, your, save yourself. Do it. Um, so, you were so focused on the key that you were prepared for an explosion. Mm-hmm. Um, what did you get again, Nelly? Sorry. No. No. Death. <laughs> death. 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 And six. Okay. But I don't want to die, so please... <laughs> <laughs> Um, uh, as as it's it explodes, you can realize as you were slowly backing away. Yeah, you saw the feathers almost in slow motion. You saw the feathers pop out uh, of the of the duck. So you realize it was actually a a, a duck, and you start to see some. Uh, internal organs so you realize it wasn't taxidermied mm. Mm. and hey Giko Skippy yes I did it good job mm. Carla <laughs> <laughs> um, and because they were really nice to you you get a save on a disadvantage so you can thank you guys. you can Aww, have a save boo-boo. bless you bless you all bless you you all. get to re-roll on every little one yeah <laughs> and every little one bless you bless you <laughs> 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 Wow. It's a one. <laughs> That's amazing. Kill me now. Can I please tell you? I literally saw that happening in slow motion. <laughs> wow. Oh, 
Guys, yeah. can you just show me mercy one so, more time? So you're, you're <laughs> yeah, okay, just keep so, your six. So you're gonna t- you're gonna take two points of damage. It is a small little duck bomb. I'm already like, I'm at like one hit point now. As <laughs> as Kira oh, falls down. I shouldn't have said that. Yeah, I, I should have been quiet and say like just, I've got. I would have, if someone have seen it's on D and D Beyond. D and D Beyond. I was like, I have ten hit points. Yeah, four. <laughs> Yeah, my character is super buff. Yeah, I I do it squats. Hey, ten hit points um, to level one is super buff. It is buff. Yeah. What did you get? Uh, nine. Uh, you're far enough away that you will take one. Oh, cool. Take one. Um, you see, uh, Kira lying on the floor. Uh, has some. Oh yeah. A little. What was that? <laughs> As oh, a, a beak is mm-hmm. sort of embedded in her arm. Ow. That's, that's yeah. just rude. You're welcome. <laughs> that's rude. Um, also, well, hi, Mulran. Thanks so much. And you just came and everyone just asked me to sing a little bit of uh, Frozen Let It Go. Oh, I, blame, yeah. I blame Nicole. So if you want to leave, now's your time. <laughs> you guys are going to... But I'm gonna, I'm gonna it. remix it for the, for the sewer, okay? Okay, okay. okay. in cool. the sewer. Heroes go down to the sewer tonight, not a footprint to be seen. A kingdom of isolation, and it looks like it's obscene. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the wind is howling like the swirling storm inside. Couldn't keep it in, even though the duck tried. <laughs> That makes us seem really gross. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Is that, uh, look, the, guys, I can't give you everything you ask for exactly how you ask for it. And then chorus. We're going to skip to chorus. Yes. As, <laughs> as the duck. Okay, but this is blow as in bomb, not blow as in... <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> Jeez. Let it blow. Let it blow. And it'll rise like the break of dawn. Let it blow. Let it blow. That duck bomb now is gone. It doesn't care if it blew Kira away. <laughs> Let the game rage on. The duck never bothered in any way. Quack, 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 quack. Quack, 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 quack. <laughs> That was awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Round of applause. Yeah. That's why yeah. I'm like, yeah. Yeah, you got Skippy. You're going to have to watch the, to, to understand the duckening. It's basically because what people put in the chat we do. Um, all right. So we are out of, um, well, we weren't in initiative, but we are out of rolling for this moment. Mm. Yeah. You can see that Kira's on the floor. You do not because you are walking I'm away. I'm walking away. Although you did I hear felt, felt some kind explosion. of impact. Mm. What are you guys doing? Um, I, I'm talking. I'm, I'm <laughs> going to retrieve. I'm, I'm going to retrieve my javelin oh, and, thanks, and, I'm, and I'm sulking. I'm, I, I need to get out of this, Funk. this place. <laughs> like, what is this place? It's dirty and and, and there's to, explosions. And I had to kill things. I've never killed things before. Cool paladins don't look at explosions. Yeah. Or they're fallen comrades no. who are paying them 33.3%. Yeah. You know what? <laughs> if one of them dies, I'll probably get more. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, what alignment are wow. you? Yeah, what kind of paladin are you? Like, no, at the, moment, I, at the moment, I'm a paladin having like, like in a, in a soul trauma. <laughs> 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 wow. No. no. You know what? I you get inspiration. <laughs> For having in a, in a soul For trauma. For not turning around because you are in this... I'm in the I zone like, of wow. yeah. I feel oh, like this wow, is a very biased you. game, right? Now. Yeah. <laughs> Do you see what's happening here? The sorcerer like, like two nat twenty guys. How often does that happen? And yet we someone... gave you. I gave you a, an extra roll and high five. He's weak. <laughs> so he's <laughs> running away. I'm not he's running. Walking, walking casually. He's well, he's walking casually. <laughs> Thank you so much. He doesn't know you're dead. I don't know that you're having that you're having these issues tsk, because tsk, I'm tsk, having my tsk. own issues. All right, Zara, if I see you. Okay. I'm Anyways, a- since we're getting our inspiration, <laughs> 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 I'm gonna run and check if uh, Kira's okay. Thank do I see you. the duck, the beak? You do see the beak. I'm gonna her. like. Mm, I don't touch that. Okay, I'm gonna like pull it out and like. Yeah, yeah it. it's 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 a little bit embedded because of those razor sharp <laughs> duck teeth. <laughs> Um, and because of the blood, <laughs> <laughs> guys, I was just gonna make a joke. Guys, that's we're not that kind of street. <laughs> I'm 
Do we need to? Do we need to <laughs> pause for technical difficulties? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wow. And this is how we don't get to affiliate <laughs> status yeah, because... This is what happens. <laughs> Never mind. Thanks, Kikoski. <laughs> hey, Cats Club. Oh, yeah, I think you just missed the duckening. Oh. But don't worry. There's been some suggestions. <clears throat> um, <clears throat> so you do get the beak out. Uh, you see that uh, yeah. she is bleeding from those wounds. Um, she's also bleeding from the neck where the Vargul bit her. Oh. Oh, yeah. Um, I do have something... <laughs> Hold on, I'll tell you what I have. I'm shaking if I have a potion, don't worry. Also, most adventurers, uh, and I will tell you this, um, also because you're a new player, Nicole, mm. um, you can stabilize a character. I'm going to stabilize So most, most, um, most adventurers would know how to stabilize. As you see that the hickey is draining, <laughs> cat's glove, is draining uh, well, Kira's life. That's so gross. you can yeah. do a little bit of first aid to stabilize her and put her on zero hit points and okay. then if she rests for an hour she gets a hit point back every hour otherwise cool. you can take her to a doctor okay yeah so healer, i'm going to <laughs> i'm gonna stabilize her and then i'm going doctors to doctors are cracks <laughs> but i'm i brought it back around <laughs> oh wow. no club <laughs> oh wow okay in medieval times in in real life i believe in doctors guys hashtag just saying science is real mm. science is thank real. you <laughs> Yeah, and then I'm going to scream out for uh, a Lauren, and I'm going to say, Yo, Paladin. Yo, Paladin. Wow. <laughs> yeah, sorry. <laughs> no, Yo, name. Paladin. So, uh, Kira's down. Uh, can you please roll perception for me, Nicole? Actually, and then Kira, please roll a percentile for me. And you want to get... Well, okay. For something to happen, you need to get slow. over 50. Oh. Do I get to roll again? I don't know, was it? It like bounced. But it landed no, on the table like of Wednesday. <laughs> Dude, I'm sorry. Okay. I'm a GM as well. I, I like, um, can't roll. 12. Oh, I got 12. Like, I oh. roll. Can I roll again? <laughs> <laughs> I got 36. Uh, I got 12. Nothing happens. You are just resting. So I'm like sleeping. Um, out. Okay. Um, you got 12. 12. For perception. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Okay, well, I got a natural one, so you're going to see this. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, you think for the briefest second as you moved the beak and started to stabilize that the beak closed oh. and you saw a wisp of something that might have done the lightest... <laughs> guys, so I don't know if this is like creepy or if it's like if I should take this it as a October, guys. It's creepy. <laughs> okay. It's deaf creepy. I'm going to turn around and look at the beak again and uh, examine it. It's closed. Okay, mm. I'm going to take it and put it in my bag. You're going to have a beak purse. Cool. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So okay, I'm going to put, put ghostly beak in bag. That's going to come back to bite you later. So, so... Mm. At, Just not in the ass, girl. At Yo Paladin, Kira is down. Yeah. Um, I am going to sheath my sword um, and go and pick her up to carry her out of the sewers. I see you, man, the potato, and yes, yes, it will be. Listen, man, the potato, it better be a good suggestion. <laughs> <laughs> good for whom? It's good for it's good for fun. It's not no. necessarily good for you guys. Yeah, so I'm I'm just going to go and pick Kira up, you know, hero style. So I'm not going to hold her like potatoes because she's a lady. Thank okay. you, guys. Can you how guys? do you not hold a person like potatoes if they're a lady? Mm. Fireman lift. Where you? So it's not a, over the shoulder. Yeah, that that's 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 rude. the potato lift. That's, oh, is that the yeah, potato that's lift? holding them like but that's a bag actually of the best lift as yeah. an aside. Also, can we please stop talking about potatoes, guys? Are you, Are you hungry? <laughs> <laughs> Also, uh, here at 27, thanks. Yeah, thanks for the um, refresh. Uh, what we were talking about is uh, one of Nelly's buttons popped. So I was like, <laughs> <laughs> Twitch is going to pull us down. Um, okay, so you're going to carry her uh, Carry her, baby like, style. what's it called? Like bridal like style. Cradle. Bridal. Like a bride. Yeah. Um, bridal style. I don't even know you, sir. I don't, I don't even, I don't even, hold me I don't even wanna. I'm just lawful good that way. And right. really polite, so I'm going to carry you out That's of the sewers. Cute. 
rude. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Ruba cute. Um, has you guy? Are you gonna start heading back to the main? Yeah. Well, I don't know the way out. Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna. Um, I'm well, gonna I mean, at the map. Are you very geographically challenged because it's literally been down the corridor and left? <laughs> yeah. No, but I mean, like, <laughs> if there's another way out, that's yeah. what I'm saying. Like, oh, okay, there were, yeah, like, it's a sure. system. There must be assume, other ways to get out. I would assume the way oh, okay. we came in, we would obviously know where the doctor is yeah. or the the healer. Is, the healer. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, well, there would there would be one in the town. One hundred percent. There's one in yeah, the town. So, uh, mm. The healer actually is probably in your guild. Oh. Yeah, so I'm going to basically say, um, Alaren, listen, we need to head back to the healer. I know where he is. Uh, just let's head back the way we came. Yeah, he's probably okay, investigating yeah. the, the body. Oh, he could be like yes. the forensic pathologist or something. Yes, but in medieval times. Yes. So the cleric. Is he a coroner? <laughs> so a he's coroner a, the type. coroner cleric. <laughs> okay, cool. So um. yeah, um, I'm going to follow behind um, Alaren just in case something badass comes behind us. Okay, um... Um, you start walking and as you start getting when you get to the T-junction you do pass a Lauren's javelin which is sticking out of a Vargul um, that you pull out and has a hole which if you want to look in you can see the Vargul is attached to what appears to be a, a, the head of the man you saw previously if you look closely yeah. I can't um, look I'm, I'm kind of busy so you do not I'll, see that I'll, take, I'll pull out the javelin for him you mm. do so. Cool. Um, you carry on down the corridor um, and you almost fall and lose your footing as a giant explosion happens above you. Oh, jeez. Well, I'm just here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so don't Kira's look at like, me. Oh, no, no. I'm just like... I'm just going chill for now. Um, I can. Um... <clears throat> So, what do you do? instinctually, giant explosion, I would have wrapped myself around this chick that I'm carrying just because that's what good people so do. So, you sort of cover her, uh, yeah. put her on the floor and cover her. Yeah. Perfect. Uh, you, you feel a slight bit of um, debris falling from the roof. Mm -hmm. But here, you guys are fine. But if you felt debris here, and you're probably about a kilometer into, uh, yeah. like away from the ladder... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That explosion was very large. I'm going to run towards it just to see if it's blocked. Um, if, like, the rocks have fallen and if it's, the entrance is blocked. But, but I have Firebolt ready to use and Dagger. You're <laughs> <laughs> just like, I'm running, I'm running. Like, well, like, not, a, like well, a video dagger. game character. Like, not my Dagger. <laughs> I've got um, a Lauren's Javelin, so oh. ready to... Ready to she steals my weapons. Are you a javelin yeah. there? <laughs> are you proficient with the javelin? Mm, can you? You are probably not. Well, I mean, look, I am. Who's to say I, I do have to use I'm, a javelin? I'm, I'm part of uh, draconic <laughs> bloodline, <see> so. <laughs> you can't just be like whipping out draconic bloodline. I'm a, I'm from, I've got blue dragon in me. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, you are one of those people who is like, in my far distant heritage, I was related to the queen. <laughs> I like, probably was, guys. <laughs> the dragon queen. The dragon queen. Which there wasn't, but there is now. Ooh. Totally. Cool. Mm. Cool, cool. <laughs> cool, cool. Um, just writing that down. Um, building law as we go. That's how homebrews work. <laughs> but also, with a javelin, guys, you just throw. I don't think you have to be proficient. No. Like, you just... You, you. It's almost like a dagger, but longer. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I'm pretty sure <laughs> even to throw a dagger, dagger, you need like, some um, kind of proficiency. Well, look, I'm proficient in throwing daggers, right? So... It's just like a long dagger. It's just like a long <laughs> dagger, guys. I love Come that. On. It's I mean, perfect. Okay. Like, cool. Let's, let's, let's see what happens. Yeah. Yeah. When Carlos says that, I know something's waiting for me. <laughs> um, you run down the corridor. You see that uh, debris has fallen down. Mm -hmm. uh, the mat. No, you won't see it. So you run up and it looks okay. There, you see some rocks that have fallen from the roof. Um, if you go climb up the ladder and try and push it, it is definitely blocked. Okay. I'm the, going to try. The cover is definitely a good blocked. I don't know if this is a good idea. I'm going to try and... Firebolt it. Okay. Are you going to try it from where you are? <laughs> Definitely not. Okay. I'm going to step down from a distance. Oh, and and, and so, di so it's not going to be directly on top. It's going to be at an angle. So if cool. it does fall, yeah. 
All right. Hmm. Roll your attack. If you get a natural 20, it'll work. Oh. Really? You couldn't just say like above 10? No. <laughs> because it's, it's, a, it's a metal cover that's blocked by things on top of it. So mm-hmm. you would have to sear the cover. I mean, look, I also have draconic resilience. <laughs> <laughs> look, as an aside, Hero 27 has personally in real life tried to throw a javelin. And he's Ooh. like, you need proficiency. I mean, look, it's not about you now, is it? <laughs> although, <laughs> although, Hero 27, can you throw daggers? Because yeah. this yeah. No, is but question. No, it's but guys, to throw a dagger, dagger, you even need proficiency. You can't just like take a, a butter knife out of your cupboard and throw it. No, but this is what we're trying to figure out, is if you can throw a dagger, can, can you throw, throw a javelin? <laughs> look, probably com- not. They're completely different weapons. It is. And distance. But the guys, way you hold also, them is different. Just remember, this is role-playing. <laughs> We can live our best lives we're here, We're going to live our best <laughs> lives. Do what you want. And we're just going to do us, you know. Um, so that didn't work. You did uh, scorch the bottom of the cover. Mm. But mm. Okay. nothing. I was doing a, a slow walk with unconscious girl. Yeah. <laughs> but Malrod's like, you can't throw a javelin, but you can throw shade. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Sorry. Nice. Okay, yeah. Um, I'm going to just shout out and say, Lauren, listen, it's blocked. I think we're going to have to go the other way. The map is near you. Hold on. I feel like I'm just not done fighting, though. What? Rage against I'm, the manhole no, cover. I'm, I'm busy carrying your friend, right? You I'm, do. I you need are going to get, get one hit point back in an hour. So, Thank I you. mean, if they're still in the sewer. <laughs> yeah, like, I'm fighting I for really my life I really need to get here. out of here. Can, may I please look well, at the map? you're sleeping for your life. May Sleep, I yeah. please look at the map? You can look at the map. see where the nearest uh, next manhole is so to the pro- exit. The problem is there's not a marked manhole cover mm. on here. Okay. Uh, as I said, it, it leads sort of, there's two corridors going off uh, off it, mm-hmm. and then there's the T junction further along, yeah. and then each of them appear to start eventually tapering down until they're a thin pipe that just lets out. Mm. That's not going to work. That's really not going to work. Okay, the water. Oh, you uh, roll because you're not from here, so you might. No, I'm not. Uh, I don't think you would know. Okay, I'm roll. Not. Do a knowledge roll for me. Knowledge what? Um, like history. Yeah, knowledge history. Mm. 18. You, I was going to say, you have to get high because y- your backstory is rich, so you might not know yeah. this. But okay, 18, they taught you about the poor people. Fine. <laughs> I, I wanted to know about the poor people. Okay, you wanted to because know. Because I'm, po- I'm proper noble. The, noble, the noble poor people's paladin. As well, yes. Okay. <laughs> as the poor people's paladin, you do know that some hedge witches and he- like hedge... Uh, ma- magic users mm-hmm. do try and steal the run of oil which yeah even though everyone knows it's extremely toxic um, and isn't actually and it's super volatile so it can't be used well <laughs> FJ's like you're so inconsiderate Kira sleeping through the adventure <laughs> <laughs> I'm just here catching some Z's relaxing um, some Z's yeah. it's extremely volatile you do know that sometimes people dig into the tunnels to mm. to sneak out the oil. So there could potentially there could be... There could potentially be an exit. An exit. Okay, so um, where's the nearest sort of um, small outlet from where we are? Mm. Um, so there's the two corridors that go off the m- middle of the main corridor, yeah. which you d- guys didn't go down. Mm. Yeah. Or there's the T-junction. You but, I mean, according to the map, where is the nearest... One of the middle ones. Okay. However, you would imagine that the people would dig in on the furthest. Uh, oh, right, to get as far away as possible. Mm. Yeah, makes so sense. that they could hear if people were in the corridor. Okay. Because, uh, as you know, there are sewer workers who come down. All right. Um, maybe do a jog. You can jog. You can I'm jog going holding Kira. She's I'm holding Kira. Your, yeah, your I'm going to do a jog. As he starts running away and doesn't explain anything to you, because as much as you've Listen, told me what you're doing, I don't have time. No, <laughs> I do not. Wow. I'd like you have I'm not just told like, your party. Like I'm like, there's this unconscious girl. I'm supposed to save her. I also really need to get out of here. This guy. Um, <laughs> I think before I follow him, I'm just gonna kind of scream up and be like, "Is anyone there? Like, uh, above?" 
uh, you shout, um, and it reverberates uh, off the manhole cover and down the sewer. Yeah. Uh, and you just hear you're the sound of your own um, echo. You mm. do, however, you're welcome, Cat's Glove, smell an odd smell. Ew. <laughs> it smells like it sulfur. Sulfur smells like eggs. I'm going to start jogging. <laughs> jogging the further away you get from the manhole cover, the, le- the, the more the smell dissipates. And you realize that there's a slight smell of it coming from the, the beak. The tiniest smell of sulfur coming from the beak. I'm going to take the beak out. Yeah. And I'm going to examine it. Oh, your beak bag. <laughs> uh, it probably needs a wash. Um, as you look at it, roll perception. Uh, it's D and D, five E. Marlon's just checking. Five E esque. <laughs> Sixteen. Some, uh, there's house house rules. Sixteen. Sixteen. Uh, Sixteen. <laughs> you you realize as you're stopping, and Lauren is just running as an aside. I'm not running, jogging. Jogging. You can't sorry. run whilst. J- 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 what if she gets more injured? Yeah. yeah. You true. and you are jostling her. So, fair enough. Carefully jogging. Like, power walking jogging. Um, what are you guys doing? Are you supposed to be dead too? <laughs> no! <laughs> um, you s- realize, w- weirdly, that that smell of sulfur is actually a smell that is associated with when the mechanical oil mm-hmm. and magic have been forced together. So that's usually a smell only like the first year sorcerers start yeah. creating. So it wasn't from the explosion. It's from the fact of how the explosion was made. Okay. I'm going to scream out for a Lauren. <laughs> uh, please roll a deck saving throw. Um, to not fall. Yes. 13. Hmm. Okay, okay, I'll, roll, I'll roll. see if that's enough. No, you're not running. It is enough. So... You don't trip over your feet, but you nearly did. <laughs> yes! I almost could have killed this woman. Did you get it, though? But she nearly did. Nearly. Yeah. Oh. oh, I didn't oh. plan that! <laughs> but yes! No. I 100% planned no, that. No, guys, no. I, she nearly did. Oh. Did I get inspiration for that? You know what? No. <laughs> because it's not you in the game. Koala. I, was, I was going to give it to you, but I'm like, it's not in game. Oh, damn. I was going to give it to you, though. Damn! Um... What are you doing? Um, yeah, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to scream out for Lauren and be like, listen, would you stop where you are? I need to speak to you. Can you not? We need to get out of He's here. He's still jogging. We, I, I mean, I'm going to... You're so fit. You're not even, like, tired. I'm a paladin. I'm, I wear full He's plate armor all the time. Before, so all I mean, the time. All built up. Look, um, Stasi is getting super irritated with the Lauren. <laughs> you are now having to shout because he is progressing yeah. down the climb. Um, I'm like, why don't you come with me? We need to get her out of here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to run towards a Lauren. Mm. Like, run, run. Cool. You guys are, you would have passed the intersectional corridor. Mm-hmm. So you're heading towards the T-junction. And then just as I catch up to him, I'm going to slap him over the head. While I'm carrying her. While you. What is wrong with you? Saving throw. Oh. Why do you like oh. this? She's all women, hey? Natural I 20. Swear it's a man thing. As, as he, he, it's like he heard the sound of the wind and he could smell the duck farts. <laughs> she came up on him. And he was like, nope, I mean ducks. Oh, that's duck, actually duck. my reaction. He ducked. <laughs> Wow. Oh, um, my gosh. Unfortunately, at Cat's Glove, they are in a very straight corridor, so it would be very difficult for her not to see him. <laughs> okay. As we're running, I'm going to be like, you're so lucky you missed that. And then I'm going to tell him. As you guys are both, like, we're both having running. a casual conversation. I'm running. It's a jog. Maybe okay, it's a run for jogging, her. It's a run for her. Um, whatever we're doing. I'm going to say to him, this duck smell <laughs> of magic. Smell my duck. <laughs> the duck smells like magic. What it smells like magic okay. and what? And mechanical. No, it's it smells like uh, 
<laughs> forced magic, it's, essentially. It's, yeah, it smells like forced magic. This is what forced magic smells like. No, and I'm not, gonna not forced, not like Star Wars. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like <laughs> forced. <laughs> it's a duh. Oh my God. Uh, please make it. <laughs> I like Please the make up. a jack saving throw. Oh, Guys, we're not going to get out of the sewer. Cat Club, I'm loving it. I'm trying it. to get out of the sewer. A deck saving throw, uh, Nicole. 14. You do stumble a little bit, but, you, but you're okay. Okay. And yeah, but as, you, as you're trying to pull out your duck. <laughs> out your yeah. No, but... but ma- Smell my duck! Magic is, magic is, is, your, is your business. It's not mine. Uh, you're going to come up to the T junction. Are we still running and talking? Yes. So, okay. I'm yes. Still running and talking. Are you going to go left or right? Uh, left was where I you looked, guys came from. I looked at the map. Where was the? So left and right are equal. Equidistance, equidistance, just one is left, one is right. Um, you do know, however, based on the map, mm. that to the left is sort of um, there's a cave and the ocean oh, over right. there. Um, and there's some further towns on the left, but there's also um, a graveyard, uh, like a giant wasteland graveyard, uh, sort of like that's a Lion King not a good vibes. Idea. Okay. Everything the light I'm going, touches. I'm going right. You didn't even hear what's on the right. No, do you know I'm there's going right? And I'm going, I'm right. going right. You this you know makes me think is. about your chats. <laughs> <laughs> My chat at Comic Con. I'm like, when someone's like, there's a beautiful Dude. place here and a forest. Where do you mm. want to go? No forest. No, but Carla said it's like. The Lion King graveyard. I mean, do you know what? Mufasa said, don't go there, Simba. And what did he do? He went there. And, and then everybody And then died. Mufasa died. Yeah. 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 Do you know what yeah, I mean? We're not Simba saying they're correlated. Yeah. But do you know yeah. what I mean? So I'm, I'm going right because right is right. <laughs> I'm going to go right because I'm forced to go right. You're As you carry on talking right. <laughs> but I'm still going to make him smell the duck. <laughs> oh, how? <laughs> smell my duck. No. Do you do this to me? <laughs> I don't I even like know what, what magic smells you're like. You're very glad you're asleep. You can weirdly feel <laughs> does, internally does, that you are glad you are asleep. Yeah. Does the smell of the duck not like jolt her a little bit? Like, like a Him. Okay. I'll roll. If I get under 50% for my percentile, you do, you'll get one. You do not get one. Oh. Damn. I was going to give I you tried. one hot HP. But you, you smell it and you're like... <laughs> not today. And then you're like, I want to wake Oh, my eyelids... I have no power in my body. Well. So you can't lift it up. I, and there's I, no I force just, magic of like... I sound so Scottish God. now. Like, <laughs> you're like, That's a force magic. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, as, you, as you're jogging and you're holding the duck above um, uh, Kira's nose, you, you s- trip a little bit and then you kind of just oh nip, God. nip a Lauren Why? on the nose with the duck. I'm okay with that. I'm not. A, I'm not okay with this. Why must this woman harass me? <laughs> FJ. <laughs> I mean, it's not an incorrect um, summarization of what's just happened. But he's like nearly got a whiff of Nicole's duck. Ah! Oh, wow. <laughs> it's not incorrect. But it was <laughs> not incorrect. It's but not incorrect. I don't want to. <laughs> you're glad you're asleep, honey. You, you don't did. want to, but you just did. Just kill me now. <laughs> yeah, she's like, take a back. I want a new girl. character. I want to start from the top. <laughs> yeah. I, I, Oh my gosh. Um, um, <laughs> okay. Can the two of you roll perception for me, please? Oh God. You see, oh my. Because I have a <laughs> You can get up my nose. Uh, we're going <sighs> to die. Five. So, I please got... Please roll perception for me, Nelly. Yes. At long last, I can do something. So, I got a one, right? But my perception's <laughs> plus four, so it's a five also. But it's still no, a one, one, and I kind of work that if it's oh, still oh, okay. a one... So you are very in, like obsessed with this duck. Seven. Yeah. Seven. That you don't realize. So you clipped a Lauren on the nose and you come back and then you're now checking if your duck is damaged. Like it didn't <laughs> lose a tooth or anything. Wow. Why are you so obsessed with the duck? Maybe yeah, because it so smells like forced magic. I don't know. Um, and oh, you, you don't notice anything. Um, Nelly, in your arms... Um, Lauren wakes up and as she wakes up from the smell of so some people are very sensitive to the smell of incorrect magic and Nelly is and uh, Kira is one of those as she rolls over falls out your arms and proceeds to throw up on the floor a little bit oh that was dignified oh wow yeah. yeah. That's nasty, girl. But it's it's dry heaving mostly because okay. you haven't eaten for a while. So nothing comes out but 
it's dry heaving, and we're not going to make the sounds because that's gross. Oh, please don't. <laughs> don't. <laughs> hey, Kristen, welcome. Hey, to Kirsty the ducking. Um, as you do so, as you're dry heaving, you look up and you're probably about uh, 500, 600 meters down the right uh, corridor. You see that the brickwork on the right, uh, on the side of the edge by the sewer, mm-hmm. so through the dip, looks like some of the bricks are have been moved. Oh, that's a really cool picture. Cthulhu. Um, and I, I only see this because these two are ducking about. Yeah, yeah. Lauren's looking at you and because, he's like, yeah, oh, you, like, you work up. I don't up. know what's going on. And uh, Stasi is just looking at her duck, checking the duck <laughs> beak. Purse is fine. Okay, I'm probably still a bit disorientated, so I kind of push my way from that and I'm walking towards the, the brick, the weird looking bricks. I'm just confused and yeah, um, you guys happening. are wearing shoes, so you can walk through the oil. Okay. And there's not a lot of it, so it's not going to affect you. Okay. Um, uh, as you walk and you confusedly touch the wall, you have one HP. Oh, 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 guys, can we just don't let me die? <laughs> Out of character. I wouldn't even know. Don't let me you die. Just she looks up. really weak. I'm like groggy, like. Pa- are you okay. not a good paladin? I look weak and frail. Oh, and you know, she is trying to figure out what the duck is going on. <laughs> and you look at the wall and you lean on one of the bricks and it falls through to the other side as you do so. Did I see that? Well, I mean, you were, were you watching her? I imagine yes. you were. Yeah. So you yeah. look up from the duck when you hear the brick fall. Okay. Okay, I'm going to run up to where she is and start pushing bricks out of that wall. Yeah, so what you see is obviously someone from the other side has stacked the bricks to try and uh, make it seem like it's still there, Mm. but they've created a a doorway which is the size of a halfling. So you guys are going to have to bend. You're going to struggle, but you you could get through. And you see it is a a dirt tunnel. Um, It looks stable-ish. There's some wooden um, uh, beams holding Mm. it up. Okay. I'm still losing. So and you can see, places. you can see a little bit. Uh, oh, you can still see lots of things because yeah. it's daylight. You can see further down that there are sl- some small um, orbs, tiny little orbs that hold light. Um, so obviously, people use this somewhat huh. regularly. But you can see that there's not been foot traffic recently, but it's to be expected because if they were trying to get oil and the oil's run out yeah. because no one's ordering from the guild. Okay, so I am actually going to be a little bit forceful. I don't want to and, and, and sort of shove the women into the hole. You're going to push the women I'm into gonna the hole? I'm going to push them into the hole because cool. they need to go just in case there's more dangerous things behind yeah. us. And All right. they could probably move a lot faster than I can. They, you guys managed yeah. to, you just bend over and yeah. you managed to slip through. Uh, Stasi, quite quickly, you are still very much hurt and groggy so you are moving I'm gonna, much more slowly. Am I able to pull her fr- when I get inside? Yeah, if you go first you could pull, pull her. Yeah. Can I still cast magic even though I'm like half dead? Yes, you can. Because I, I... It's it's only um, things that require constant... So magic is innate for you Yeah. Um, and because you have spell slots I'm going to say it doesn't draw from your body. Okay. But... Um, Doing like if you were to try and swing a sword, that would be hard. Okay, because the the pathway we're walking through is it dark or like can we actually see well enough? He's got his daylight scarf, so okay, you yeah. can see. I, I won't nice do anything. But as you guys go through, you realize you're gonna have to pull a Lauren. Yeah, I've he got is really big, very shoulders. big for for the initial doorway. Yeah. The the corridor gets slightly bigger. Yeah. But it's, you're going to have to be careful with him when you pass the beam supports because he might break the structures. Mm. So he's going to have to move very carefully and I'm probably be pulled okay. Okay. Quite, okay. quite far. He might have to actually lie down. Uh, Stasi, maybe you should try to help the paladin. I'm going yes, to please follow us. Please. Um, I'm going to go ahead and you can try to pull the paladin because I'm still fine. I'm completely weak. okay you would with not that. Be able to yeah, I'm, I'm, I just look at him and I know I can't. So let me just speak along. I um, attempt to pull Alaren. Um, Alaren's going to try and help you, so yeah. he's going to elbow it. Yeah, yeah I'm going to do a bit of a worm wiggle, like that breakdancing move. I'm going to try. You're going to do the worm? Yeah. 
Word. Yeah. Cool. You guys yeah. do progress, <laughs> but it's slow. Yeah. Oh, it's, it's very okay. slow. You don't feel like it's slow, um, Kira. You are tired. Oh, feels this, like this, feels like, this feels like this feels like you know you know that when you've just when you've woken up and you want to still like you you wake up in the middle of the night and you want to go to the bathroom but you want to still stay asleep yeah so you keep your eyes and you're just like oh. that's that's your vibe I'm in a nice fuzzy state okay <laughs> yeah well, no you don't know <laughs> guys. <laughs> The anxiety that I get every time Carla Googles from this chat. I yeah. know. It's not cool. I know. As you're, as you're, cool. as you're uh, uh, crawling through the, the tunnel, you feel that some dirt is sliding in between the plates of your armor. Getting so dirty. I have oil of slipperiness. That might help. Why no. do you have oil of slipperiness? I don't know, guys. It looked cool on the <laughs> It did. Oil of slipperiness. Look, it looks like it's a bad kind of handy. Like, I'm I mean, uh, that, that could work. I, I, I will you, ask Alaren. I'm going to say this. I'm going to say, Alaren, I have oil of slipperiness in my, in my spells here. Do you want me to well, use well, it? Well, it's, it's an actual vial. It's a vial. It's yeah. something you own. In my vial. <laughs> <laughs> that <Yep>. sounds terrible. <laughs> yeah. You might, you might just scare Do you away. want me to use them? <laughs> You'll be like, like, I where? just want your permission to use oil of slipperiness on you. I don't want you to hate it on me. Oh. Cat's glove, I love you. She's like, lube him up. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I, I, apologize if you, I apologize if I gave you a gender pronoun. And oh, shit. Get, Cat club. It. The cat was like, "Loop him up." I apologize for giving you a gender I pronoun. It. I love it. <laughs> Listen, cat club is you up. Dog. Yeah. Do you have to say it like that? <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, Lauren. Oh wait, no, I'm gonna do it like this. I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna like stop pulling him, and I'm gonna hold on to his hands, and then I'm gonna look at him like a dead in the eye, oh, no. and I'm gonna say. Cats club. Alaren, do you want me to use my oil of slipperiness to get you out of here? But like in that super sexy, seductive... Like James Bond. Let's get out of here. Yeah, With but like of slipperiness. As, 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 can I ask you and, the and, like, and I'm gonna <laughs> use I'm gonna And I'm going to use my charm. I would like to use my charm for this. Okay. Oh. All right, roll charm. So is roll it, inside. will it even work? Should it work because of Alaren's issues? Oh, roll inside. Uh, what issues do you have? What issues do you have? Marlon. <laughs> That's a lot, but I love it. 14. What 14. Am I rolling? Charisma. 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 Um, 18. Oh. You really want to get out of here, so you're going to allow it this one time. This one time. I'm going to let this woman but cover it's me gonna in give oil. You it's a slippery slope, though, this one it time. It is a slippery <laughs> slope. <laughs> Um, That's what they always say. Like, no, just try it once. Just, just yeah, one, yeah. one time. So, what you guys have received from this is, um, Nelly. Every time you smell forced magic, yes, you are gonna get queasy. Oh. And, Lauren, all of slipperiness is just gonna give you a, a weird, like, ugh. It's gonna be like every time you sit. The sea oil of slipperiness. All. Oh God. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And yes, cat's glove. All right. Okay. Mm-hmm. You, uh, she, you're going to just pour it on him. I'm going to lather it. Thank God. Gonna, thank well, God I don't for know armor. if you can lather on armor. So I guess well, it's like, it's like gonna, Q20. Yeah, I'm going to like, put it in like the hinges. I'm going to, but like I'm going to, I'm, I'm going to try my luck. But why? Why must you traumatize my character like I'm, this? I'm not making it weird, guys. This is me getting him back. For what? irritating what? me the whole time. I practically killed so, all of the Volgo, and you're like. So the thing is, like she what? can see you're annoyed by it, and she's doing it. More. I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying. That I'm, so I'm, problematic. <laughs> yeah, 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 it does. <laughs> Why are girls like this? Why <laughs> malicious? Malicious. Um. All right. As it goes, it does Shh. loosen up the. I <laughs> 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 It does. Uh, it does loosen up the j- the hinges of your of your armor. Yeah. It actually, it's like it, it works. works. It's, it's useful. useful. It's medieval Q twenty. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm saving him and, time, guys. And you feel that <laughs> it had such potential. Now, so Frank, you understand. <laughs> um, and you start m- being able to move slightly faster okay. because it's no longer you're not 
Almost, you know, when you push uh, sand, it yeah. starts to build up mm. a, a barrier, yeah. Yeah. which was taking you so long. Now the sand is touching the oil of slipperiness oh, okay. and turning into mud and sliding under you. So you're moving much faster, but your plate is going to be dirty and muddy. oily and yes. disgusting. As you guys progress down the corridor, um, Nelly, because you're in the front, yes. you see that you start to realize that you're actually progressing upwards. And the light you're starting to see is actual daylight. Like natural light. <laughs> like natural light. Okay. Can I, I'm going to go a bit like cautiously because one, I'm a bit almost dead. And also, I just don't want to die if anything comes at me. I would generally walk in front of... Um, There's no place to maneuver in this corridor. Yeah. Oh, so she would definitely be in front of me. Okay. Okay. So I'm stuck. Okay. Mm. So I'm going to just... You still have to pull the Lauren. I mean, he's oh, slipping I still faster, but pulling. he still needs okay. a bit of... Oh. But it is starting to open up. Okay. Can I roll perception to just check that there's nothing, as much as I can, nothing nefarious ahead of me? Uh, yes. Okay. Kind of don't laugh. <laughs> it, it scares me when you laugh. Okay. Guys, the chat is evil. I love it. Okay. That wasn't terrible. Eleven. Seems clear. Oh, and she does it like that. <laughs> that looks so Guys. <laughs> Don't lie to me. <laughs> this is Carla's lying voice. Let me show you. It's clear. <laughs> that little inflection. Yeah. Everything's fine. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. Wow. Okay. okay. This is why we came on to a place where people can see my face, where I'm like, okay. Yeah, okay. I mean, you can do that. Do oh. I notice that Kira's walking while I'm... Helping Alara. Yeah, I mean, you've been pulling and you're like okay. checking on her. So, yeah, you I'm going to scream out and I'm going to tell her to wait, to like stop where she is and literally just wait for me. Then, how are we going to get out if. Because we'll, we'll all walk together, but if I'm helping we're you. Like, there is, it is opening up. You couldn't all come out at the same time, oh. but if two of you wanted to peep out the tunnel, like you wouldn't be able to move out yeah. together, like you'd be but able you could to, be like. Yeah. Okay. Pop yeah, head up only because like look, she's like literally just come out of her dying state. So I don't expect it to die again. No, oh. uh, shame she cares. Yeah, just a little I do. Bit too. Okay, I guess I hear her. Um, everyone in the tunnel hears you. <laughs> so what? yeah, that was not comforting. I'm, I'm taking out a dagger while I'm calling about because obviously I need. Do we dagger. detect magic? Like. More forced magic. Um, besides the duck. You you don't know? You don't smell any forced magic? I don't magic. feel queasy? You don't... F well, I mean, you feel a bit queasy because the duck's around. Okay. Also, you're half dead, so... Yeah. Mm. <laughs> um. Kirsten is triggered, guys. You are triggering Kirsten. <laughs> okay, Stassi, wow. come here. I want you to <laughs> also see if you, if you see anything strange. I oh. leave Aloran. Uh, Aloran's going to just keep... I'm going to keep going. Um... But you realize now that the mud is starting to cake in your armor. Oh. So it's armor. you're able to move, but it's going to be, you're going to be stuck almost at a, like a right angle hinge until you clean your armor. That's so gross. My <laughs> beautiful, expensive, one of a kind. Wow. Armor. Okay, cat's glove. I love it. But also we need to keep the chat a little tidier <laughs> than that. Oh. What did you say? Oh, I, I can't tell you. I, I mean, look, just whisper it. Whisper it. <laughs> whisper it. <laughs> just you, can, you can do like a little sign language. Do like, like a, a little do like charade. A, Basically, like a, she's like, someone's going to come out. <laughs> out the tunnel. I'm, I, I just think. <laughs> like I said, it is an interactive game, but I do reserve the right <laughs> to not do everything. <laughs> but don't stop, Cat's Club. <laughs> This whole episode is because of you. The duckening. <laughs> yeah. Pop oh, goes the ghost stuff. duck. <laughs> you hear, okay. you hear ever so slightly, but only you. I'm going to look around everywhere. Nothing? No. It was super quiet. Did I hear which direction it came from? Yourself? I'm going to look at the duck. It looks like a weird duck beak. Not attached to anything else. I'm going to take my sling 
and I'm gonna wrap it around its mouth. You're gonna seal the like seal it. All right. You hear? <laughs> <laughs> I have to try to make it like a closed one. Like go. Does it come back a duck again? No, guys. I'm Hunter also have something for this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm like Kira in her in her infinite uh, oh conscious wisdom is like just holding on her dagger and she's moving out the tunnel and then you hear ow <laughs> <laughs> as her hand comes out the tunnel and obviously pricks somebody. I retreat quickly. <laughs> uh, we are supposed to be. <laughs> Marlon's like first lube now bondage, <laughs> guys. And then Nelly's shirt popped open. <laughs> and then she poked someone. Yeah, guys. It's yeah. getting super real out here. Um, at that, can everybody roll initiative? Oh, oh damn, Nelly. Wow. You see what you caused, girl? You didn't move. Quick enough. 18. 15. 15. Um, wait, 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 wait. Sorry, I'm lying. Uh, initiative, 16. right? Yeah. <laughs> 12. Okay. Uh, 18 for Alarm. Yeah. Which is really helpful. Considering yeah, exactly. I can't do can't anything. Past anybody. I can't Sweet. do anything. Uh, Stasi. 12. Starting on 12? 16. 16 for uh, Kira. Kira, 16. Mm-hmm. Oh, I got the farting chair. <laughs> <laughs> I got the farting chair. Yeah. Uh, cool. <laughs> He's definitely going to have a trouble. But I think that's going to bring us to the end of tonight's episode as next week we see what happens. I don't know what doffing is, guys. Now I feel like... I don't know what that is. Do you, don't, don't search it with like an image... Image search. <laughs> on a search text. Yeah, it, always a search of the safe search on your images. Okay. Yeah. But <laughs> thank you so, so much, everyone, for, for watching. And if you're on the podcast side, thank you so, so much for listening. Please remember, come join us on the Twitch side. Mm. And if you're on Twitch side, just follow us everywhere. Like really cool, creepy stalker fans, but like nice ones. Yeah. And remember to, if you enjoyed this, please share it with your friends, folks, families, and familiars. Like us, share us, and Marlon says it's not gross, so that's cool. Uh, <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> he didn't say we're not gross. We're still gross. Oh, oh yeah. Um, no, but <laughs> I mean, I mean, his suggestion was not gross, oh, and, okay. and I'm, I'm grateful for that. Oh yes, you doff your armor. Yeah, doff yeah. is taking off. Oh, thank goodness. Um, take it off. No, I don't <laughs> want to take it off okay, now. Okay, no, we're, we're definitely ending the stream. <laughs> <now. laughs> I had to stick with the theme, guys. Yeah, yeah, just. Thank you so, so much for listening. Remember, share it with your friends, foes, families, and familiars. A huge thank you to my players who do make everything an adventure. And really, really thank you to everyone in the chat. Um, oh, stunningly fun. Or only, it was only a little stunningly fun. <laughs> what? Okay, thank <laughs> And you're welcome. <laughs> um, please remember you can catch us here same time next week, 7.15 South African Standard Time or CAT. I think that's Central African Time. But it's not Central African Time. It's we are cent- Central African Time. No, we're not Central African Time. Central African Time, I think, is... It's the center of Africa. No. South Africa's... Everywhere. No, it's not. It's not. It's no. GMT plus two. It's GMT plus GMT two. GMT plus two. Green Witch Mean Time. Yeah. Yay! <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, and follow us on all the socials at Dum Dum Die, spelled D-U-M-D-U-M-D-I-E. If you'd like to mail us, you can mail us at dumdumdiepod at gmail.com. And we will see you next week. Until then, I hope you have a most amazing week filled with adventure.